First things first, we want to give all I praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Brock the Yahweh, Brock the Yahweh Shai. And we give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that feed us with knowledge and understanding. And much love to the elect man on the four corners of the planet Earth that's been set up through faith to help seal the elect, man. And um, we're in the Day of Atonement right now, okay? Me and his brother just, you know, the Spirit jumped on us to, to get in. Get into a lesson and mm -hmm. jump into a lesson and, you know, and just feed ourselves. Because we were just talking priorly that this is the food, man. Yeah. This is the true food. And you got guys talking about, oh, it's not a day of fasting. Forget that, man. And deuce is plugged out, man. This mm -hmm. this day is a day of, 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 of humbling yourself in front of the Lord and, 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 and striping this flesh, man. Putting stripes upon it because this flesh rules us in this, in this when we're in these bodies, man. This flesh rules. That's why Paul said I, 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 he's worn in his members, man. Mm -hmm. You know, the things that he does not want to do, that, 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 that does he do. You know, so that shows you this flesh right here, we're at war with it, man. Our spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Same thing Yahweh Shah said. Yeah. When he was on the boat, he told it, the, the, flesh is, the flesh is weak, but the spirit that's in us, that the, the, the Lord willing to be an elect spirit, man, it, 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 wants, it wants righteousness, man. It wants it, man. We crave it. We, we, we crave it like we crave when you used to be in the world. You want to be a so-called success. That's what our success is, to have a, a pure flesh, man. Or pure, pure minds and the Lord to make these bodies go with the spirit, man. Just like the angels are. The angels don't go off, man. Right. They don't go off. So that war in heaven and hell, that's uh, that's backwards, man. That's not what this thing is. That's why when the Lord comes back, he's going to change us and we're going to have heavenly bodies, man. Mm. We're going to have we're going to have angelic bodies. We're not going to go off. We're, our spirit is going to rule that 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 vehicle that we're in, man. Yeah. Okay. And like I was trying to say, he's going to put his law in our hearts. Mm. And our hearts is our mind. Con, lob. Yeah. Man, I just had a verse too for you too, Hawk. Huh? As soon as you said that, it says man cannot change stony for fleshly. If I can find it, Lord willing. Either way. But there's a right. verse I just read today. It says... How can men change from stony into into fleshly? Because we have these stony hearts. How are we going to be able to convert these stony hearts when the Lord does not give us that fleshly heart yet? Mm -hmm. So we're stuck. When that's why I call it hard head. We're stuck in these hard headed bodies till the Lord converts us and turns us into a, a, a fleshly heart, to where we can pretty much absorb the laws and statues in our inward parts and we're made perfect, man. Right. So we're gonna get right into this thing. You want to give me uh, Ecclesiasticus 14 and 22? Alright, what's in Come. Oh, yep. Already there. Mm -hmm. Go after her as one traceth and lie and wait in her ways. Mm hmm. 15 2? Uh, what do you get? Please ask us 14 and 21, so like you. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. It's right here. If you can find the 14 and 21. Got it. Okay. He that can. Considereth her ways in his heart. Con. She'll also have understanding in her secrets. Yep, see? That's the saying we were just going into in before we started. This thing is secretive, man. Of course you come in, that's why it says many are called, but few are chosen, man. And that's why it says, Blessed is he that readeth, is blessed is he that understandeth. You gotta understand this thing because David also said that this let their table be made a a, a, a snare, man. A trap. So this word, this same word that is for your salvation to turn into a trap to so the the unworthily man. Mm -hmm. This is a it's a it's a it's a labyrinth. It's full of different death, death. It, it is around every corner in this thing because if you don't come to the fullness and uh, knowledge of Yahweh Shem Yah Shai man, it, there ain't no making it. And we're coming to hectic times. We just had this situation in Japan where the United States military base was was hit by they don't know what. But there was more. I seen a videotape. There was multiple explosions, man. What it, multiple? And they say you can smell gunpowder in the air. Mm. So it, we're we're we we at the door of this thing. We don't even know what's popping behind. It's the weekend, right. so the news people are really not moving too much. But there's some happening that we we're gonna get it tomorrow, man. Okay, and, and we'll see when we get off of this this day of atonement what things are gonna take place, man. So read that again, huh? Alright, you say, He that considereth her ways in his heart shall also have understanding in her secrets. Huh. 
And then this is the uh, precept. This is the book of John, uh, Joel 9 or 29 in verse 4. And I'm going to have you give me Revelations 3 and 20. And it, it, it says, this is uh, Joel 29 and verse 4. It says, verse 3, When his candle shined upon my head, and when, and when by his light I walked through darkness, mm. in this world there's gross darkness, okay? Yeah. We're looking at the darkest this world has been, man. I just seen today that Target is taking away gender. Uh, yes, yeah. You see, Amazon now is taking it away. So what does that breed? Confusion. I was just gonna say that. It breeds confusion, man. Why would why why would Target why would Target a a, a business like that take away gender? And they're going to toys, man. They're not going to teenage stuff. They're going. It's really that big of a deal. I think it's awesome and about time. A big makeover for a major retailer, Target, eliminating signs that separate girls from boys on some of its merchandise. Good evening, everyone. Through the years, parents have been able to find their toys and other merchandise for their children. They just follow the signs mm -hmm. to the boys in the girls section. Yeah, but that's about to change inside Target stores. The retailer has decided to do away with any gender-based signs. Local 12 News reporter Larry Davis is live outside the Target store in Newport with a look at how shoppers are reacting to this decision. I'm real curious, Larry. Hi, Paula. Well, toys and other merchandise like bedding will no longer be separated by gender inside Target stores but they will now be together in one section. There will be no more boys section, no more girls section. Now, reaction to the decision has been mixed both online and also right here in the Target park parking lot in Newport. In a statement from the retailer announcing its move away from gender-based signs, Target says customers have raised questions about merchandise selections based on gender. Target now says suggesting products by gender is unnecessary. Some of those shopping at the Target in Newport agree. It's good. I mean, I feel like the kids should be able to play with whatever they want. It shouldn't be required that they need to play with the princess just because they're a girl. If a boy wants to dress up in a skirt or whatever, let them. Jillian Cranley says she has a niece who plays with both X-Men and princesses. Dan Beck is also in favor of the Target move. I think it's a great idea, actually. I think girls should be encouraged to play with all kinds of toys. They shouldn't be um, pushed into one track ahead of time. If they want to grow up and be engineers or scientists, they should have the toys that, you know, promote those kind of career options in the future. But not everyone is in favor of Target eliminating signs based on gender. On the Local 12 Facebook page, viewers sounded off. Melissa Wilkerson says this is just stupid. I hope Target sees how ignorant they are, really people, get over the gender thing and concentrate on more important things. On the toys, and what does toys go with? That goes with children. Mm -hmm. they're, they're attacking children, man. That's why it says that they want to take away, oh, boy and girl. So they're going to be teaching that in school. Yeah. They're going to be teaching that, oh, you can be whatever you want. There's, some, there's one state that's allowing 15-year-olds to get sex changes without their parents' consent without their parents consent man so that's showing you that society yeah they say you look we can pull up the article they said that this certain state is giving rights to 15 year olds to get sex changes without their parents uh, approval man so they're saying the parents don't got power no more man so that shows you we're in babylon yeah. what is the word babylon babal means confusion man and it says this is job 9 or 29 and 4 or 3 it says, when his candle shined upon my head, and when his light, it says, and when by his light I walked through darkness, as I was in the days of my youth, when the secrets of the Most High was upon my tabernacle. And that word tabernacle there, let me get the word. That word tabernacle there in verse 4, tent your house, your dwelling. We know a tabernacle, but it's tent, your dwelling. You see that? Let me read it again. As I was in the days of my youth, that's why I said, seek me, seek him in the days of thy youth. Yeah. 
grow old in this thing. This is something you grow. It's like wine, it, it, exactly like wine. Like, the best wine is aged. Go ahead. Yeah, just like the scriptures say, seek him early. Seek him when he may be found. Mm -hmm. You see, seek him early. Seek him as early as you can. It's right. it, we, we actually we're supposed to tell our children of the Lord's name when they're little, man. Right. When they're, they're supposed to grow up in this thing, you know, not n at least knowing the Lord's name right. and, and the laws when they can just know it. But right. when they come to twelve and that parishion, it, it, you turn it up a little bit. Yeah. You turn up the heat on them and, and, and put the Lord's name, and you you tell them things they're not supposed to eat, things they're not supposed to do. That's not that goes against the law. But then when they come into that, they grow in, and then they they start getting the mind of themselves, and then they jump into it, and then the Lord starts you know dealing with them on a certain type of level. But that's why as us being young, we're growing in this thing, and we're being under tutors. Even Paul was under tutors, man. Okay, so this thing is not something you just get into and you just got it. it it's an order thing, man. You got to be taught. So if you grow into it, you're going to grow into the knowledge and you're going to learn with the, if you learn the right way, you're going to have it, then you'll be able to give it to other men and this thing just keeps going. Beyond, that's why it's beyond us. It's not a us thing. It's not a men thing. It's just the fact that this truth and this word that's, that'll outlive us, man. This word has been around since the beginning of this thing. Right. Since the beginning of time, man. Mm -hmm. Let me read it again. And it says, When I was in the days of my youth, when the secrets of the Most High was upon my tabernacle, when the Almighty was yet with me, when my children were about me. It says, And when I washed my steps. That's it on that. Give me that revelation, Zach. Uh, revelation uh, 3 and 20. So... Uh. And then it says you can go and renew. All right. Behold, what I stand at the door and knock. Yep. If any man hear my voice uh. and open the door, yep. I will come in and will sup with him. Yep. And that's what that's what I was just saying. When you grow old into this me. thing. Yep. Yep. The Most High is going. He's going to come in with. He's going to come. He wants to come in, man. Yeah. He's at the door. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, you see. You know, and right. you know, everybody's been through this. There's nothing. There's a, it, it sucks when you sitting at the door just knocking. Right, just. And especially when you know they home. Yeah, yeah. You like, like I just called yeah, them, like, man. I, I just know this nigga. I know home. you home, man. What? Right. <laughs> and if you really cool with right. them, you are gonna be like, hey, man. Right. You gonna almost start yelling at first. You are gonna be like, hey, man, I'm out here. Right. That's what the, that's what this Lord the, the Most High has done yeah. to us. He's yelling at us like, hey, man, open the door. Right. He's knocking at the door. I just want to talk talk to you. That's it. Come on, man. I I know you dress. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I can see you, man. Right. You especially here. <laughs> it's something worse when you see him at the window. Right. And you're like, hey, man, I'm at uh -huh. the door. Come on. And you right. just looking around. You stumbling yeah. and running around the right. house. Like, oh, hold on one minute, man. Right. Like, that's what Jake be doing when yeah. we when we talk. We prophesy to him. Mm -hmm. They be like, oh, man. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll be back, man. Yeah. Them dudes, I love when they say that. Oh, man, I'll be right back. You right here now. Right. Where you gotta go? You can leave to like, your death. Oh, uh, where my ugly man? Fuck her. her. Fuck her, man. Right. Cause she gonna be in your ear like, oh, don't go back there, right. baby. Mm -hmm. You know, she might be like, oh, I give you some of this coochie. Just don't go back there. Then what you gonna do? Then you gonna you, you right. don't know you don't know us, so you gonna want to get that coochie instead mm -hmm. of coming back and listening, man. Right. So you should have been there at that time and, and, and sucked it in while you had the opportunity. Mm -hmm. And then this is the book of uh, Ecclesiasticus or Ecle uh, Ezekiel two. And verse 2, and it says, and, and they, whether they will hear or whether they will forbear, for they are a rebellious house, yet shall they know that there has been a prophet among them. See? So mm -hmm. it's a that rebellious nation, man, that don't want to attain unto the words. But keep read that in Revelations, all right? All right. The same. same yep, 20, yep. All right. Behold, I stand at, I stand at the door and knock. Mm -hmm. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come in. Oh. I will come in to him mm -hmm. and sup with him, and he with me. And he with me. That's the thing about it. It's a dual thing, man. Mm -hmm. The most I supping with us, we're supping with him, man, just to, to understand. And how are we doing that now? By the Day of Atonement. Yeah. Because that's how we're returning the favor until we're not returning. No, we can't return nothing. There's nothing we can do to return it. But we're giving our best of our ability to say, look, Lord, we're atoning for us. We know we messed up. We know we're, we're filthy and we want to atone for it. So that's that's why we do these fasts, man. 
and, and, and Lord willing, more, if the Lord allow me, I try to do more fast, man. Because mm -hmm. it's not something, that, it's not an easy, them dudes out there talking, oh man, fast is nothing. You're tripping, man. You're tripping. Yeah, it's a hard thing, but in the same sense, it's an easy thing. Because we're not, the Lord ain't asking, he said, he's not doing, he's asking of us, but it's not a great thing. Look what Yahweh Shah's done, man. Mm-hmm. You know, that is, that, that's what you got an example. The thing we're doing is is, is, is is small, man. To fast for a day and to, and to let this flesh be, 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 how you say, pushed to the side for 24 hours, man. Lifestyle medicine is the use of lifestyle interventions directed at the treatment, management, and prevention of disease. I just want to take a minute to talk about all the potential benefits of fasting. I made another longer lecture that goes into much more detail about the background of fasting, how it works potential risks and dangers of fasting, and fasting as it regards to weight loss and cleansing. Uh, I would strongly encourage you to watch that whole video if you're interested in learning more about fasting. Uh, right now, I'm just going to go over all the potential benefits of fasting for various studies and research uh, as quickly as I can. In animal models, we see the following potential benefits. Uh, one study showed that it could extend lifespan and improve health. Another study showed better insulin control and reduce nerve cell injury. Studies have also shown reduced risk of diabetes, heart disease, and certain types of cancer. And more recently, in a rat study, uh, it showed an improvement in the immune system. In various human studies, we see the following potential benefits. Uh, improved asthma and reduction in certain inflammatory markers, reduction in heart rate, blood pressure, cholesterol, and triglycerides, potentially helpful with Alzheimer's and Parkinson's, a reduction in inflammatory markers, including CRP, interleukin-6, and homocysteine, reduced risk of diabetes in at-risk folks, and an increase in human growth hormone. More research is needed regarding the immune system, any benefits to the digestive tract and uh, psychological benefits. And finally, I will add that very few of these studies are robust, randomized clinical trials. While all of this preliminary research is promising and interesting, much more research is needed to identify any true benefits and long-term effects.